Hey everyone, this is Josh Hayes here. I'm gonna try to show y'all some Morse code on ham radio. Okay, let's see. I heard a ham radio Morse code station earlier. Let's see here. I'm gonna go to 40 meters instead of 20 meters. Let's see here if we hear any. Yeah, there's a lot of Morse code. Wow. I'm going to put it on Morse code or CW mode. And there's already a station right there. You know, this radio has a good decoder in it. Good ham radio Morse code decoder. Let's see. I'm trying to figure out those frequencies, where they're at. See how it's flashing? Now I'm gonna hold the button key. See all that, y'all? It's actually decoding all that. Fan. K9 something. Let's see, I'm gonna go to the stronger Morse code signal. That's pretty strong though, signal. For Morse code, let's see. It's a fast one, man. Sometimes the signals, you know, they come and go. There's one. Just got to get it tuned in right. Let's tuned in right. Let's see here. That's a good one. I'm going to increase my RF gain. Sometimes that increases the signal, or you can understand it better. I'm trying to get the light to flash. That's when it decodes the Morse code. It's really neat how it decodes all that. It knows how to decode all that. It's really cool. Sometimes if you increase the bandwidth, it'll read the signal better too, for some reason. There we go. Just for the receiver. Oh, 
S5QEST. Maybe that means Eastern Standard Time. As long as you can get that signal dialed in for that, uh, you know, that light, that's how it really starts to decode it really good. Right there, it's better. Well, you just got to get it dialed into the perfect frequency, I believe. Basically, when that light goes a lot faster, when it with every do, 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 everything you hear when it when it matches that like that, then that means it'll decode it better. M eight J Q. This has some really good Morse code uh, decoding. It says test K seven J. Test K eight Q F Q test K eight J Q C Q E E S E E E E H J Q T N test U eight J Q Anyways, y'all, this is how you could decode the Morse code. And when you're ready to turn Morse code decoder off, you just hold the key button. And then it goes back to the waterfall on the G90 screen. Anyways, y'all, this is Josh Hayes. I hope you all enjoyed this video. May God bless you all and have a wonderful day. Thank you.